Welcome back to our Swift We Stock app tutorial series. In this fifth part, we will take our app to the next level by incorporating financial news. Users will be able to stay updated with the latest news related to the stocks they are interested in. Let's get started. Create a new Swift UI file called News View. Swift. This file will be responsible for displaying the financial news. Inside the News View, Swift file create a vast stack to structure our view. We'll start by adding a navigation title to provide context to our users. We'll use the navigation title to achieve this. Add a navigation title modifier with an appropriate title for our news section. In order to see our navigation title on top, let's modify the preview. Wrap the news view in a navigation stack within the preview code. This will give us a visual representation of how our navigation title will appear in the app. Now that we have our news view, let's go back to our content view file and replace the placeholder text with our newly created news view. And we will also wrap our news view in a navigation stack. This will integrate the news section into our main app view. Open the stock protocol file in your Xcode project. Inside the file, we'll be adding a new function to fetch financial news. This function will be asynchronous, capable of throwing errors, and will have a return type of a model called news model. Let's open out stock service, which is conformed to our stock protocol. In this function, we begin by constructing the URL for fetching new sentiment data from the Alpha Vantage API using the provided API key. We then make an asynchronous network request using URL session, shared, data, from, URL, and obtain the response and data. We perform error checks to ensure a successful response and status code, and then decode the JSON data into our new model object using JSON decoder.
Now let's create out News View Model in View Model folder. We will import observation and annotate our class with observation. The News View Model is initialized with a stock service instance, which is used to fetch news data. The Get News function is an asynchronous function that fetches news and sentiment data from the stock service. The eObservable attribute indicates that the News View state property can be observed for changes. The news view model has a news view state property that represents the current state of the news view. The news view state enum defines the possible states of the news view, initial, loading, loaded data, and error. And case of successful data retrieval, the news view state is set to loaded, data, with the fetched data. If an error occurs during the fetching process, the news view state is set to error, or error, with the corresponding error message. Open your project in Xcode and locate the NewsView file. This file contains the implementation of the NewsView responsible for displaying financial news. The NewsView is structured using a VAV step. Within the view, we handle different states based on NewsView model, NewsView state. The A-Task modifier is used to call the GetNews, function of the news view model when the view appears. The news view is structured using a VI stack. Within the view, we handle different states based on the news view model, news view state. When the view is in the EEN initial or loading state, a progress view is displayed to indicate that data is being fetched. If an error occurs during data fetching, the view enters the ER state and an error message is displayed to the user. In the alloed state, a list is used to display the financial news data. Each news item is represented by a link component containing the title, summary, and an image. The image is loaded asynchronously using the asyncs image component. 